Good morning, guys. It's uh, May 7, 2020. Uh, another day of Lanai resident hunt. Um, hunting, kind of the same spot as hunting last time. But today we got a lot more movement. Uh, I see a few more deer than usual. Um, two does above me. Um, there's a buck and a, a doe feeding down about two gulches away. And there's a ram kind of below me here. Um, just kind of feeding. I'm gonna try and see what turns up and maybe we'll get some some does today but yeah thank you for staying tuned and hope um everybody's staying safe and all right guys Straight up and over. Uh, at about 2:45. Uh, just too slow. I'll try and cross this gulch and maybe we'll meet up with the other bucks too. All right, stay tuned. What's up, guys? Um, there's a few does this morning. They're at about 20-45 yards. Try to set up, but this wasn't fast enough. But crossing this little ravine here. I'm gonna try and make it to the top and see if they're still crossing over to the other side of that draw. A lot of game this morning. I got a few hunters across, maybe about 600 yards away, so I'm trying to make it as fast as I can to the top. Guys, looks like the buck ran away. I did not see him leave, but I'm gonna all the little green now. He's down in the bigger gulch below me. Since the shot went off, I got spooked and 
the other does with him ran. Oh. Public hunting. Bound to happen, but stay tuned. Maybe we'll figure out where he is and possibly get a shot on him. Alright, guys. What's up guys? Uh, so I spotted a herd of bucks. They're at about 850 yards. Uh, they're bedded down right now. Just waiting for them to stand and try and take a shot. Dialed up to uh, 22 minutes on my night force in excess scope. And yeah, gonna try them out. Alright guys. Oh, I got him. What's up, guys? Uh, they shot a buck. Shot him at 850 yards. Um, they were bedded down at first. So I'm waiting for the bigger buck to stand up once he stood up. Uh, braced myself with my rifle and sent it uh, Looks like he's down I'm gonna give him a little time and then uh, Check him out But yeah, finally got it done on the Night port and excess scope um, If he's down that'll be my farthest confirmed kill with my Ruger precision rifle All right guys <laughs> So guys I uh, loop back around to a closer spot to um, try and head down towards the buck. Um, I waited about 10 to 15 minutes after um, after the shot. He's bedded down under a tree. I could just see his head, but looks like he's down. Uh, just gave him a little bit of time and came back out a couple hours later. But yeah, I'm gonna start heading down and check him out. All right, guys, day two. On the buck. Oh, he's embedded, but he's still alive. Sneak down and try on the second shot. All right, guys.
What's up guys? Thank you for staying tuned. Got a second shot on the buck. Uh, shot him again at 140 yards. Uh, he pretty much is laying bedded down. There's a doe with him. That kind of gave away his position. He's looking intently on where he was. Everything was kind of the same when you're closer by the um, area you shoot. And finally found him. Um, he presented me with uh, kind of a neck shot. So dialed to uh, 140 yards and this sent it. I'm gonna go check him out, but uh, stay tuned, guys. Yeah. Horns. Oh, spot on, but the horns coming out. How's it, guys? Got my buck. Shot him at 850 yards. Yeah. Had to take a second shot at 140 yards, but. families and friends during this um, pandemic. Yeah. Thank you guys. Um, if you haven't yet, please like, subscribe, stay tuned. Action boys! Well guys, thank you for staying tuned. Got my buck. Shot it mad. First shot was at 850 yards out for about two hours noticed that he's still alive but came back a few hours later um, I had a hard time finding him in this uh, foliage up here everything kind of looks the same but luckily there was a doe that was kind of hanging around him so saw, spotted the doe and then I spotted the buck right after got a second shot at 140 yards down yeah. uh, thank you to uh, again to Pulama Lanai and hunts for the Lai community to provide for our families and friends. Gee. And this is going to be my farthest confirmed kill with the Ruger Precision Rifle and 6.5. Alright, thanks guys for staying tuned and hope you're enjoying. Um, if you haven't yet, please like, subscribe, and stay tuned. Action, boys! Gee. Yes, sir! Uh, yes, sir! Uh.